Southeast Asia is famous for its beautiful beaches and islands, and it shows. People travel from all over the world to spend their vacation at an island beach, with their feet in crystal clear water and a drink in their hand. Since Southeast Asian beaches are so popular, some can get a bit crowded. But luckily, with so many islands and beaches available for people to explore, you can still find a beautiful beach that isn't overrun with other tourists. So these are a few 10 and touch Southeast Asian islands you need to explore. 10. Flores Island Flores Island is a remarkable destination amidst the Indonesian archipelago. Located far east of Bali and Lombok, many visitors disregard Flores in favor of its more popular neighbors. But it's a pity, as the island has a lot to offer. Boasting pink sand beaches, smoldering volcanoes, and Komodo dragons, it is an island that screams adventure. Flores spells diving, eco-tours, and mountain climbing. Interspersed with visits to prehistoric heritage sites, traditional villages and cultural events, find some of the world's most exotic underwater life, dive in the pristine seas of Komodo, or swim along with huge manta rays, dolphins and dugongs. 9. Koh Yao Yai Located in the Andaman Sea, halfway between Phuket and Krabi, sits the one of Thailand's last and touched islands Koh Yao Yai. A true paradise of spectacular beaches, rubber and coconut plantations, picturesque sunsets and amazing sea life. A trip to Koh Yao Yai is the closest you will ever experience to real Thailand. Immerse yourself in the local culture whilst surrounded by pure nature. Beaches include low parrot and low jark, the latter with a pier for ferries and long tail boats. The surrounding waters are rich in coral and dotted with dive sites, like the King Cruiser Wreck near Anemone Reef, and the pinnacles of Shark Point. Once you have arrived by traditional long-tail boat, you will never want to leave. 8. Koh Kud One of the top attractive islands in Thailand is Koh Kud, another island that is easy to travel from Bangkok. Besides its clear water and fine white sand, this island is famous for its peacefulness which is now known as Andaman of the East Sea. The villagers' simple way of life can also be experienced here. Koh Kud is the last island on the eastern coast of Thailand, considered as another district of Trat. It will be Cambodia's territorial waters if you go further. It is the fourth largest island in Thailand with 25 kilometers long and 12 kilometers wide. It consists of 24 large and small islands divided into three groups which are Koh Kud, Koh Rad, and Koh Mai Chi. Koh Kud is another island in Thailand that is still completely natural. In addition, there is a rich mangrove forest and various coral reefs. Many waterfalls are located on the island, especially Klong Kao Waterfall, which flows all year impresses many people. 7. Pulau Tiamen Known for its dazzling corals and white sand beaches, Tiamen Island is the perfect destination for a weekend getaway from the mainland or even nearby Singapore. Off the east coast of Malaysia and very close to the private island Badu Badu, Tiamen is smaller than its more well-known counterpart, Langkawi. But there are still many things to do in Tiamen Island in Malaysia. Malaysia definitely has some of the best beaches in Southeast Asia, as well as the dreamiest overwater bungalows in Asia and Pulau Tiamen delivers. There is more to Tiamen Island than learning to dive on a weekend levy aboard. It's also a fantastic beach destination for Singaporeans beyond Indonesian Bintan and Batam and its own busy beaches. 6. Koh Chang Koh Chang is Thailand's second largest island and the primary destination for those visiting Koh Chang Marine National Park, which includes dozens of unspoiled islands. Located in Trat Province, about 300 kilometers east of Bangkok and not far from the Cambodian border. Koh Chang is 70% covered by unspoiled rainforest, and the island's permanent residents are only gradually becoming more involved in tourism. Drawn to Koh Chang's pristine beaches and sparkling water, more well-to-do Thai and international travelers have been discovering Koh Chang, and numerous luxury spas and resorts have sprung up to cater to them. Nonetheless, the island is still a dream destination for budget travelers and families, with a wide variety of affordable accommodation options and numerous gorgeous and tranquil beaches surrounded by crystal clear water. 5. The Perhension Islands 
Just off the northeast coast of peninsular Malaysia, the Perhentians are a pair of islands that boast brilliantly white sand beaches, thickly jungled interiors and crystalline waters, where you can find some of the best snorkeling in the region. The islands also have many popular dive sites offshore and are a good base for exploring the smaller islands that dot the deep blue waters nearby. In the west is Kassel and in the east is Bissar. Dasar is the most popular option, drawing thick crowds. Smaller Kessel has quieter beaches but offers only simple places to stay like Bubu Long Beach Resort. Despite this lack of infrastructure, the island's location in the heart of a marine sanctuary makes it an alluring destination for those interested in underwater life. 4. Nusa Lembongan Nusa Lembongan is a small island off the southeast coast of the main island of Bali, quickly becoming one of Bali's most popular attractions. This island paradise is a world away from the hassle and hectic pace of South Bali. Either hawkers nor traffic mar the magnificent scenery, this is a fine place to just put your feet up and relax. Main activities include surfing, diving and snorkeling. The water is some of the clearest you will find anywhere, and a vivid aqua blue in color. Many areas around the island are good for diving and snorkeling, with abundant marine life and healthy coral. Jungat Baru and Mushroom Bay are the two main beach areas have traditionally attracted visitors. Jungat Baru in the northwest is the bigger of the two, and has myriad hotels and cheap eateries. Mushroom Bay to the southwest of Jungat Baru is a quaint, attractive and sheltered bay. 3. Phu Quoc Phu Quoc Island boasts idyllic beaches, romantic sunsets, evergreen forests, and a serene atmosphere, making it an ideal holiday destination for travelers looking to escape bustling city life. Located 45 kilometers west of Ha Tai in the far south of Vietnam, the northern part of the island is relatively untouched due to its status as a UNESCO-listed national park but there are plenty of luxurious resorts funky bars, and quaint cafes along the southern coastline. Aside from beachside activities, visitors can also explore traditional villages, expansive nature parks and Buddhist pagodas, all of which are easily accessible via motorcycle, taxi, bus or even day trips by reputable companies. Catering to just about any budget level and preference, Phu Quoc's dining scene ranges from local markets selling fresh seafood and Vietnamese street food, to expat-owned bistros offering authentic Western and European fare. 2. Koh Rong Samloan Located just off the coast of Sihanoukville, Cambodia, Koh Rong Samloan is Koh Rong's stunning sister island. It is a peaceful relaxing destination with breathtaking scenery pristine white beaches, clear turquoise ocean waters, and a tropical jungle wilderness. A real island paradise, as it is often called by tourists, there are many spectacular tourist locations on Koh Rong Samloan. The main tourist beach, Saracen Bay, creates a quiet laid-back atmosphere with several resorts along its front. Experience a little bit of culture at Empire Bay or isolate yourself with a Robinson Crusoe-style experience at Lazy Beach and Sunset Beach. Most people visit Koh Rong Samloan between the middle of November and the start of May, as during these months there are beautiful hot days, with very little cloud and low humidity. 1. Moyo Island Framed by the beyond blue waters and iridescent coral reefs of the Flores Sea, Moyo is ravishingly remote. Lying east of Bali and Lombok and just north of larger neighbor Sumbawa Island. Once there, you'll encounter 350 square kilometers of lush forest, sultry savanna and pristine beaches. On land, spend days trekking to pretty waterfalls, soaking up spa treatments, or wildlife spotting fellow residents include rusa deer, wild ox, boar and macaque monkeys with brilliant bird life up above. Offshore, get active with world-class snorkeling, diving, sailing, fishing and island hopping, or just relax on empty beaches, swim with turtles, and stargaze on the sand. There's just a few villages and one luxury camp on the island, so you've got the place to yourself. Thanks for watching this video. Please like, share and subscribe. Also don't forget to hit the bell icon. Bye for now.